Hey guys, so in this tutorial, we are going to learn how to convert an object into a JSON format. So let's get started. So here in my Android Studio IDE, I have created a Flutter project in which I am going to just make use of this file that I have created that is object to json.dart. Okay, so I can just run this single file by right clicking on it and run this file. And I can just get the result over here. So you can see I'm just printing it. Okay, so let's check out how we can convert an object to a JSON format. So for this here, I am going to create a class uh, by which I can create an object. So let me write the code to create a class over here. So let's create a class by name users. Okay, so here I am going to accept uh, some parameters like username and his age. So final string name final int age. Okay, so these are the two parameters I am going to make use of. Okay, so to initialize this, I'm making use of a constructor. So let me create a constructor. So let me rename this user to capital U. So here I will just create a constructor user and just initialize the variable by making use of this dot name and this dot age. So whenever I create an object, this constructor will work and initialize this parameter to them. So now I want to write a function that can convert my object into a JSON format. Okay, so here I will just write a comment. Uh, create a function to convert user JSON. Okay, so here I'm just going to create a map that that will of that will be of type data type string, and second parameter will be a dynamic. Okay, so let me tell you why. Okay, so here I'll just name this function as to JSON. Okay, and this function will just return us the data by converting our uh, object into json format so here i am going to send name first of all and second one is the age okay age okay so now here i have just defined this data type return data type because you can see the first parameter is of type string and the second parameter is of type dynamic that means that i can send either a string or else i can send a number or if i need i can just send a boolean type so i'm just naming it as uh, dynamic okay so here i have just created a class so now i can just create an object by making use of this class so let me do this over here so user user1 user the first parameter is the name of type string so i will just pass my name and the second parameter is of type integer i can just pass any number like an age so this will get stored as an object format in this variable that is object variable Okay, so I want to just convert this variable into a JSON format. So I can just make use of this function that exists in this class itself. So let me show you how. So here I'm just creating a string, JSON string. I can just name it, I can name it anything. And then I can, I must make use of JSON encoding. So JSON encoder, JSON encode. And here I need to pass my object. So user dot to JSON. Okay, so here I'm just getting an error. So let's check. So I think so it's JSON encode. Yeah, so this is the uh, default uh, ob function that we must make use of that exist in this convert uh, class. Okay, so now if I print this and now let me run this code by right clicking run object. So you can see I have just converted my object into a JSON format. Okay. Yeah, so that's all for this video tutorial. Thanks for watching. Please do subscribe. Protocol as point. Thank you.